Man, I was just born into it, really. My mother, uh, she really got me into art, to be honest. She used to do a lot of sketches of the old, like, Nuggets coaches. Uh, she would tell me, teach me a lot about black art. You know, honestly, think about it. Street art has been around forever. <laughs> I mean, it, it hasn't always been a spray paint, but it's always been around. In, in a city like Denver, where you have so many people from various places that come in, it, it, it kind of stirs the pot into like a really cool flavor because you have influences from all over the country, you know, and uh, Denver is so warm towards people doing murals and street art and things like that and creates a lot of opportunities for artists, which is what we also want to do. It's a lot of like um, just realization that there's a bigger story to tell uh, than like, you know, the surface level thoughts behind art. You know, honestly, during COVID and everything, I, I was kind of itching to just get out in the fresh air and do something. Right now, culturally, it's really important because you have small children who are trying to process what's going on. And a lot of times when they see it illustrated in a, in a graphical format, it makes more sense to them. You know, and the repetition of seeing Black Lives Matter over and over and over again creates a dialogue to, to get people to you know, want to talk about how do we change this.